Hello friends, so we have done some work on introductory work on writing essay. They will be planning your time is most important. You have 40 minutes. First 10 minutes for your uh, jotting down thoughts that come to you. You know, you need not edit unedited bundle of ideas, you can say, or thoughts. And then that you want, that's what you call brainstorming, brainstorming, or so doing some of the work you can say. And brainstorming, I have done my way, you can do it your way. <laughs> the thoughts that might have hit me need not hit you. Some other thoughts may come, so you can make use of that. And after that you are right and write and accept. So here as you can see, the what I have done here, you have for example nucle nuclear energy. First thing that comes to your mind is developing nations, developed nations, how they are, how they are, uh, they, they are craving for energy, because without energy there is no progress. Then you find the nuclear energy, plus points, carbon free, no carbon dioxide. Yeah. It's the cleanest energy that comes to your mind like that, you know. Then you, you can see that uh, so one of the cheapest options you can see. Massive energy. Massive energy. Uh, the great British philosopher and they say Bertrand Russell had foretold that in future cities will be lighted by artificial moons. And who will supply the energy for that? Nuclear energy. And then you have got the, you have, uh, there's no possibility of acid rain. 11% of the world's electricity, elect, electricity needs are met by uh, nuclear energy. It's very really lasting because once you start, you know, the radioactivity or you can say the fission process. Uh, uh, starts, then it will go on. The snow question of global warming is not weather dependent. For example, other things are weather dependent solar energy, wind energy, wave energy, hydroelectric. So, these are weather dependent. If there is no rain, no hydroelectric projects. And it is low cost, but in the initial cost is very really high. Once commissioned, you can forget about that. And uh, you can also see. Uh, some of the plus points that come to my mind. So I just do down. Then comes notes like, you know, um, you need globalization requires energy. Sustainable energy is required. Sustainable waste disposal. That's a big problem as far as this uh, nuclear energy is concerned. And you have got uh, Waste disposal, of course, is a big uh, problem. The nuclear war is a possibility. Terrorists may, some terrorist groups could get uh, in contact with such kind of things. And you have got uh, leakage problems out there. See that? And in case of any leakage or something like that, then the water bodies, not only of that place, but Many places, air pollution, water pollution. Examples here of Fukushima in Japan and Chernobyl in Russia. And then you have got the, the initial expenditure is very high. Uh, destroy the world, the, the just power, you know, to destroy the world several times or this. And then you can see the, the there can be stockpiling of nuclear weapons in their arsenals of one war mongers. One war mongers means people who are belligerent means fighting. You know, those who have got by nature they they, are, they want to quarrel and fight. If it is a quarrel between two persons you say it's a quarrel, but if it is two nations it will become a war. Understand? So that is and so the problem here is 
a, a na catastrophe, for example, natural, say tsunami, earthquake, this can sometimes create problems in the sense that, you know, they can, uh, they can uh, cause partial destruction or even damage to uh, these plants, nuclear plants. So, these are all negative points. And finally, you conclude, you, you have got some points like that. Sustainable waste disposal important. That's, that part you can use for your conclusion and also uh, it is, it, you, need, you have to, you need it. So if you don't take safeguard, enough safeguards, what will happen? It will be like Frankenstein's monster. <laughs> what happened to Frankenstein's monster, you know? The monster ate the scientist. Like that. Atomic or the nuclear energy can eat the world. In the sense of what does that mean? Means destroy the world. So these are spare thoughts. Now you can pick, you need not use all these ideas, pack all these ideas into your essay, but the relevant ones and also keeping in time this, keeping in your mind the time limit. You can write an essay. Understand? It's very simple. Very simple. I think you have benefited out of this and so bye.